in that area. So this is about the time when it was at its strongest, about 242 earlier this afternoon in Butte County. There's Biggs, so kind of off to the east southeast of Biggs. Orville is up here, and you can kind of see this little inflow area right here. That's that little hook echo as you get those strong southeast and easterly winds right into the storm. Now I'll have to step off the screen real quick to show this next graphic because I have to back up the radar uh, to when we were seeing this, but I'll back it all the way back to about 242 that we were just seeing. And what you're seeing right here, this is the velocity. So the radar is picking up the wind speeds and the wind direction. So uh, basically, wherever you see the greens, that's winds that are moving towards the south, towards the Sacramento site. Reds off to the north away from the Sacramento site. So you've got this circulation. So again, this is right about the time that the storm was at its strongest. And I'm going to step off one more time uh, just to back up the radar all the way back to this. This is a 3D volume scan of the storm. So I'm going to back it up to about 242. And what you'll notice that this thunderstorm was uh, seeing uh, its updraft all the way up to about 20,000 feet on this 3D volume scan. And right here, that's where we had those strong southeasterly winds coming into it. And then you have these west northwesterly winds on the backside. So right where these kind of rotate in, you get these little quick spin ups. And sometimes that's what will produce those tornadoes uh, with these uh, strong uh, thunderstorms. Back to you. Thank you, Rob. Well,